hey guys welcome back to another video today i'll be showing you guys how to make a quick snap for one of these right here so what happened if you uh, about to go on a fishing trip and you notice you ran out something like this okay but you do have a whole bunch of these safety pins at home okay so this is how you are going to uh, turn one of these safety pin as big as you can you know the biggest one you can find to catch like you know a thousand pound fish or you can find like a really small one uh, to make to catch like you know a five pound fish okay one of these right here you can catch a 50 pound fish no problem at all once it hook onto onto like this it is very very strong okay very strong uh, a very strong snap like, like this uh, you you can make at home and it's only going to take about a minute to two okay now the first time you make it maybe it take a little longer than five minutes but after that you get used to it it's take you like one or two minutes okay so let's get to it um, you can make it as big as this one or bigger out of a safety pin or you can go as low as you know as small as this as possible really if you can handle the pin you can make one okay so um you have a smaller pin like this you can make it out of that but it's just a little harder for you to do so uh, but i'm gonna show you guys how to do it on a medium size uh, just like this one and for me um, a medium size like this once it hook uh, up like that you can fish up to about 50 pound no problem at all with just this uh, safety pin right here and this is about about an inch and a half you know one and a half inch like this so it should be okay all right so first of all we're gonna again we're gonna remove the the head pin just like this so again this is a instructional video so it's gonna take a little longer longer to show you guys but if uh, Without a video, you probably can make it within like a minute or two, okay? So it's just that simple, okay? Uh, first of all, the the pin on the bottom, you got to have a curl uh, plier just like this one. Stick it in or any plier that fit, stick it in just like that. And we're going to twist it all the way, okay? okay just like that so as you can see see just like that and use another plier you're going to use another plier and hold it like this okay on the side just kind of clamp it on the side like that and then you're going to bend this area bend out just a little bit okay so let's see if i can show you guys the easy way okay so use your circular and bend out like that so basically you're going to make a small a, a small curve just like this one right here and you're going to do it on both sides so flip it over or whichever way is easy for you guys and do that okay and we're going to do it one more time flip just like that so basically you're going to get a a bend on both sides just like this okay and make sure it's straight now so I'm gonna use this ply right here and kind of straighten out a little bit you know straight it sometimes it just bend in a weird way all right and for the for the tip of this side you notice this you can cut it off to make it look nice or you can just leave it and uh, make it straight okay you don't have to really make it straight it just you know look nicer and you're gonna make a uh, make sure you bend it inward okay so the circle is here you bend it inward okay so just like that and you're gonna make it basically you're trying to make a circle out of that and then that this is basically almost a full 
circle and then you're gonna make another one down here uh, which is about a half circle okay basically and again you're gonna bend at the same same angle there we go just like that you see how now how it how it's forming up just like that very nice okay very nice and easy and this one right here uh, you're gonna start from the top basically you're gonna make a little more hook right here and it's gonna hook into this part right here okay so close it real quick and the hole the hole is gonna be about right here so basically you're gonna start from the bottom and notice and you're gonna turn it this way okay you're gonna turn it up to here don't turn it here i mean you can but it doesn't look much better or if you do like this uh, you can do that too but i like to do a sideways like this so basically you're gonna turn this way okay so let's start from the top and just work your way in okay so if you do it if you do it too uh too low you won't be able to close it okay uh so basically you just kind of roll it like this and there you go there's your hook you're gonna it's gonna be like this so you're gonna do is bend back a little bit so basically you're gonna put goes in here and bend this back so it look a little nicer okay there we go just like that so basically you go you will see like a small curve right here curve out and then go into a circle and that way it can go right onto uh, this right here now if you notice I purpose, uh, purposely do it, it so it'd be a little higher longer like this right longer higher like that so I cannot snap this onto here that is not a problem at all the only thing is when you do it too short but if it's too long like that no problem you can always roll it down some more okay sew it to fit perfectly in there okay and then again you can just go in there and bend it out just a little bit like that and this can easily fit into here there we go okay and that is how you can you can make a really quick snap and this is believe it guys this is really really strong you can make this hole big no problem you can make it real small but my plier um, is not strong on the tip so i'll make it a little bigger uh, if not you can make it smaller that's fine too but this one believe me this can hold a 50 pound um a 50 pound fish no problem at all okay and that is how you make a, a quick snap hook okay